alaikum. Hi, my name is Muhammad and I'm from the UTS Muslim Society. Congratulations on making it to university. I'm sure you studied really hard throughout your final year at school and are waiting in anticipation for your first day to begin. Most probably you don't know what to expect or what to look out for. So MSAs across the state have taken the opportunity to show you everything you need to know about university life, both as a new student, but most importantly, as a Muslim on campus. Let me pass you on to UWS now, when the Dean will give you an insight into what to expect at university. Thanks for that, Mohammed. Hi, my name is Nadine and I'm from the UWS MSA Parramatta. While at university, you are most likely going to be thrown into the deep end of a totally new and unfamiliar environment that is different to what you were used to in high school. Before you get started at university, there's a few things you may want to know. First of all, you are going to be given a whole lot more freedom and independence, and with regards to your studies, it is highly unlikely that you are going to be spoon-fed on what to do or how to do it. Be prepared for many sleepless nights and lots and lots and lots of studying. There's also a lot of diversity at uni and you're bound to meet many different people from all walks of life. There will be a change of environment, of setting, of friends, of social circles, of ideas and so on. Uni is indeed a melting pot of all these things. Thus, you've got a lot to expect and much to be excited and nervous about. Inshallah, Brother Hisham can give you a taste of all the things we encourage you to do as you get ready for university. Thanks Nadine. Salams everyone. My name is Hisham from Macquarie University and the I'm sure you're all impatiently awaiting all the exciting events and fun activities that await you at university. The first thing I would advise you to do is to find the right support on campus. You're going to make plenty of colourful friendships and it's important to choose the right ones. This way, you'll always have someone there for you when the times get tough and you need some help and you'll always have those extra study notes when exam time comes along. Also, when looking for support, be sure to approach your local MSA. They'll provide you with all the help and support you need. They'll also be able to give you the relevant information that you'll need at university, such as your local halal food places, your local university musalla, upcoming MSA events such as Islamic Awareness Week, and MSA iftars. But most importantly, be active and take on some responsibility on campus. Show initiative and contribute to your community. It will be a good way to help you grow and get some experience for your future. Now I'll pass you on to Amatullah and she'll tell you a few things that you should avoid while at university. Thanks Hisham. Assalamu alaikum. My name is Amatullah. I'm from Sydney Uni. With all the extra freedom you get at university also comes with responsibilities that you might have to take up just to make sure that you don't fall in the traps of such a different environment. Try and remember that you're Muslim and you're always representing Muslims. So be on your best behaviour and try and portray us in the best of light. Just some pointers, some advice about things that you should keep away from, things not to do. My first advice to you is to stay away from the bar area and the hangout spots at uni because they'll be a major cause of distraction to your uni and to your studies. And also it's usually filled with a lot of haram. Second advice, go to all your lectures and all your tutes because trust me, you'll understand what we mean during exam period. Um, try and stay up to date with all your uni work. Don't let yourself fall behind. And my last advice to you is try and minimise the interaction with the opposite sex and, you know, don't mix with the wrong crowd. I'm now passing on to Brother Ilyas who will give us some advice to the international students just starting out at uni. My name is Ilyas Atiyah from the MSA at UNSW. There are some things that you'll need to consider when starting university as an international student. Make sure you pick out the appropriate housemates and find appropriate accommodation. The last thing you want is to have to sleep on campus. Secondly, join the MSA. You have no idea what benefits you can get from the brothers and sisters who live on campus. The university won't be there for you 24-7, but the brothers and sisters on campus definitely will. Thirdly, living away from home can be tough. So find your local musallah and get involved in the local community. In that way, you will be able to make the most out of your stay here in Australia. On behalf of all the students at my university, I wish you all the success. So you've heard from university students themselves. Life as an Australian Muslim at university can prove challenging, especially when making a transition from high school to university. However, MSAs across the state are working hard to provide you guys with the fundamental things that will help you on campus and represent your Muslim identity, such as prayer rooms, wudu facilities, Islamic literature, events and initiatives, and etc. 
So be sure to support them, volunteer for them, and bring your friends along too. You're thrown into deep water at university, but the MSA on campus will help you stay afloat. We look forward to seeing you on campus. Assalamu alaikum.